In this video, we present a robust, real-time, and state-of-the-art end-to-end radar odometry system. We achieve this by utilizing a learned embedding space largely free of sensing artifacts and distractor objects. In order to achieve this, our approach only leverages ground truth pose information as a training signal generated in a self-supervised way and negates the need for handcrafted features. Evaluating on this data, we outperform the previous state-of-the-art in radar odometry by a factor of 1.5 whilst running over an order of magnitude faster. As an added benefit due to our architecture choice, our method is as interpretable as approaches currently used by the community. Compared to other sensing modalities such as vision or LIDAR, radar has received relatively little attention in the context of robot navigation. FMCW radar operates much like commonly used LIDAR by taking measurements of the world as it spins. Our robots now need to see further through fog, rain and snow, despite lens flare or when directly facing the sun. Radar holds great promise in tackling many of these shortcomings. However, it is also a notoriously challenging sensor modality. Radar applications are typically blighted by heterogeneous noise artifacts, such as speckle noise, saturation, and ghost reflections. With these challenges in mind, to achieve robust pose estimation, we leverage a deep neural network to learn an essentially artifact and distraction-free embedding space optimal for pose estimation. We start with a baseline architecture without any learning based on correlative scan matching. For a given pair of raw radar inputs, we first convert them into Cartesian space. Secondly, we sample one of the scans at various angle offsets. We then calculate the cross-correlation between each rotated sample and the other scan. Performing this cross-correlation as an element-wise product in the Fourier domain it is extremely fast and efficient. Finally, we use a weighted sum of the correlation volume to predict our relative pose to subgrid resolution accuracy. We propose to improve on this baseline method by incorporating learning into the architecture prior to the cross-correlation. In our proposed architecture, given a raw radar scan, we predict an element-wise mask M using a convolutional neural network. We take the element-wise product of this mask and the radar input, resulting in a feature map we hope to be more robust as well as artifact and distractor free for pose estimation. The rest of the architecture remains unchanged. Crucially, our pose matching formulation is fully differentiable, allowing us to explicitly learn a representation and mass generated network optimized for pose prediction rather than on some other proxy task. To train our system, we use data from the recently released Oxford Radar Robot Car data set, which comes with both raw radar data and optimised ground truth pose locations. The provided poses were optimised using visual odometry, visual loop closures and GPS across numerous overlapping traversals of the same route. Additionally, to validate our hypothesis that optimising for pose is more beneficial than on a proxy task, we use this data to automatically label baseline distractor-free masks using a multi-session mapping entropy-based approach. At runtime, we use a vehicle only equipped with a radar. Using the train network, we take the raw radar input and produce live masks, which result in a feature map optimal for pose prediction. These feature maps are used to generate our correlation volume from which we deduce pose. We evaluated our approach on 64 kilometers of urban driving in a variety of different weather and traffic conditions. We show our radar odometry system outperforms prior state-of-the-art with significantly reduced odometry error by a factor of 1.5 whilst running an order of magnitude faster at 60 Hz. Because of our approach, we are able to qualitatively inspect and interpret the feature maps produced in our architecture. We can see that many of the artifacts in the raw radar scans are suppressed, such as saturation and speckle noise, as well as many objects such as cars, leaving only the stable static structure that we might expect, such as walls and buildings. Specifically looking at the radar artifacts we identified previously, we can see that our masking approach correctly removes saturation, ghost reflections and speckle noise, leaving only the true occupied cells in the scene. In conclusion, by using a deep network to filter raw radar scans with masks explicitly optimised for pose prediction, we are able to use efficient correlative scan matching to achieve state-of-the-art radar pose prediction. Our method is robust, has low error over large distances as seen here, and performs at well over real-time speeds, all of which makes it suitable for urban autonomy.